All right. Wow. So uh, I guess we'll start here. Yeah. Okay. That's that's the beginning of the let's play. Okay. That's how it's gonna start. Yeah, what, that what, works. What's up, gangsters? It's me, Jesus Christ. And uh, I'm Matt Watson, and we're here with Jackson Tucker as well, and Howdy. we're playing Hotline Miami, because uh, we I, we've never played this game on the channel. Always wanted to, uh, but. This this game is a little we, rage. We did music. play Hotline Milwaukee. Yeah, we played Hotline Milwaukee, uh, which was like a a much better version, if you ask me. But Jackson likes Hotline Miami a lot, and from what I've heard, he's a, he's pretty much a champion. Well, you're gonna set your fans up to get really angry, and they'll be uh. Uh, that'll happen regardless. So don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but this is like Matt Watson said that Jackson <laughs> Tucker was a professional at Hotline Miami, mm -hmm. and then I watched him die several several times. <sighs> I'm I'm here to tell you how to kill Ryan McGee from I'm, Super Mega. Um this game is controlled with the left and right stick. Press right bumper to punch, aim for the face once you've knocked someone out. Yisham. Okay. To do this, you press the A button. You got it. You got it, Jackson. I got it. I'm just making. I don't want anybody to get mad at me in the comments. No, Jack. You can. I you can. You this. can skip. You could skip the. Is there? Is there like a big story you have to follow at all? Yes. Uh, yeah. This game definitely has a very good story, but it's a. Uh... I mean, I'm excited. I've I've played this. I played this when I was in uh, college. I really like this game. I've never beaten it though. It's a. Uh, it's definitely tricky. But I've always wanted to. Uh, you know, see someone else play it and do good. Oh. Okay. Oh wait, we did play this one in college, didn't we? Yeah. Part one. It was like this and Peggle every day. Dude, this we just sat back and played Peggle and It this was shit. fun, but like also really depressing. And who do we have here? Oh, you don't know who you are? Maybe we should leave it that way. Ryan. Uh um But I know ya. <laughs> That's good. Is that Ryan McGee? <laughs> yeah, that's just Ryan on the couch. Look at my face. We've met before. Haven't haven't we? Jackson. Is this one me? Yeah. It's yeah. You. Uh, I don't know you. <laughs> Why are you here? You're no guest of mine. Uh, your fans are gonna hate that voice. Do you really want me to reveal who you? <coughs> that hurts my throat too. Much. I'm gonna switch it up real quick. My voice just hurts in general. Yeah, Ryan's actually sick, sick right now. Yeah. So. I'm sorry for making you do voices while you're sick. No, it's fine, dude. Do you really want me to reveal who you are? <sighs> Knowing oneself means acknowledging one's actions. This is like a criminal gang, right? Uh, no. As of lately, you've done some terrible things. They're all... They, you, so, I, I don't know, if, you know, it's you, like, it's not shown in the story. You don't remember me? I'll give you a clue. Haha, <laughs> babak. Does April the 3rd <laughs> mean anything to you? <laughs> you speak speaking rhymes from now on, right? <laughs> <laughs> I believe that was the day of our first encounter, Malay Day. <laughs> you look like you might be remembering something. Ellipses. Ellipses. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I just want Ryan like one of those characters in a black exploitation just, film who just like, just like always speaks in a rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> when I when I got out of my car, I knew danger well, wouldn't be far. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are in the super megaplex. No, this is nicer than the Super Megaplex. <laughs> this right here is where we all sit around and record games. Yeah, that's the bed we share. Busting through doors to pull <laughs> down those drawers. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you spoke like that. <laughs> Hi, this is Tim at the bakery. You should, your order should be delivered by now. Unfortunately, you have a homosexual wedding, and we do not cater to. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'll be uh I'll be Richard for this one. Oh oh oh, oh, oh okay. Dick. You'll be my yeah. voice then. Does that mean I have to talk? Um, you have to keep up the voice for this entire segment. <laughs> you can't stop talking until the level's over. Bang bang. All right, give us some commentary as Richard. Shit, bro. <laughs> ah, ah, snap. Snap. Sorry, was is it my character? No, I'm sorry. Or? Sorry. I I I was I was helping. You know, you know when you don't talk when you don't talk for like 5 seconds, I can hear you trail in behind me, Matt. I'm sorry, Ryan. I just wanted some. This uh, is my this is my time to shine, and you're taking it away okay, from me. I won't say anything. I'm else. sick, and it, it makes Ignore, it even more. You're difficult. wasting time right now by fighting. Wasting me on this. time. Yeah, you, I, I'm you talking be... to a friend about something that I'm pretty upset about. If that's wasting your time, then I'm sorry. It's the middle not of the even level, an apology though. can fix this. Well, I'm sorry. No, as I said, did you not hear what I just no, said? I, I heard you said not even an apology can. So fix we're this. so were you just trying to get under my skin? 
No, I think an apology, even if it's not going to fix it, it's still the right thing to do. It might be the right thing to do, but is there anything else you can do to help fix the situation? I could drive to a gas station to get me a big bottle of water. Do you want me to do that? So, Matt, what are the, what are the odds uh, you, you drive to the gas station to get your friend Ryan a bottle, bottle of, of non-flavored, non-whatever, spe no special, regular water? Uh, 15. 15? Yeah. Three, two, one, Six. seven. Oh, oh. Ooh. That was a close one there, fellas. That was a real close one. God, now I'm just going to have to stay sick. Ryan, don't put that on me, man. No, my friend Matt just didn't want to help help me out. No, I, I did want to help you out. That's why He's, I set the odds so low. You just said the wrong number. Seems like that was rather high to me. Chapter clear, baby. <gasps> oh. What happened there? You threw up? Nah. Nah. He, he bled green. I Killings. Think it, I think it was poo-poo. <laughs> it might have been a little poo-poo. Hi, hi there, man. Haven't seen you around. Is that a good voice? Is that one funny? That's good. Enough? I mean... Yeah. You seemed really down over losing your girlfriend. Don't remember seeing you after that. It looks like Brent in a disguise. No, that's, that's like, <laughs> it does look like Brent in a disguise. Like, like if Brent put on a wig and some glasses and wasn't sterile. So out for a midnight snack, <laughs> and huh? And didn't have red hair. It looks like he took Danny's wig. Yeah, that, that kind of does look like that. If, if Danny straightened his wig and dyed it. Yeah. Well, you know, he did have the straightened wig for the one Game Grumps Tim in a Power Hour thing. Oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, I thought that was a really cool way to really get, because he was afraid that the audience was catching on to the fact that he was wearing a wig. But uh, he's like, "Oh, if we smart. do something about my hair, then if, if especially if I show people in a in a beauty salon touching it and and they'll, they'll dealing with it, they'll all, they'll think it's real for sure. Because why would I go into a beauty salon with a wig unless we had paid the people ahead of time to be in the video and let them know uh, that." Keep keep up the facade that there is a wig. Can you imagine a universe where our friendship ends because Danny legitimately gets upset of the fact that we start spreading this rumor? <laughs> this 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 man is like, you told people I have a wig? What? No, it's real. It's real hair, love. You are look. deceitful, conniving little fucks, and I can't be friends with you anymore. <laughs> he actually like the barrier of trust has been broken. He, he cuts it all off with us, <laughs> like he won't even speak to us. <laughs> He censors us out of every Ninja Sex Party music video. I mean, he, d he he did get pretty upset near the end of our tenure at Game Grumps. Over the fart sound? <laughs> well, yeah, that too. What else was there? Oh, the, just the faces? Just the faces. I really do. I love just the overall style of this game, though. It's I do very too. funny to watch someone play it. Oh, look, it's he's uh, Brent's a pizza man now. He works at a pizza restaurant. Um, So, our, so is this like... What I've gathered, these guys were running some kind of, some underground shit, there's right? Some, there's some kind of racket going there, on. There, there, there's, know. there's some kind of racket going on. Yeah. So the big thing is the guys you're killing are all Russian mafia members. So we're killing the Russian mob. Yeah. If there's one if mob for influencing the election. Oh, okay. Yeah. So the 2016 we, elections. So you're, you're actually playing as uh, one of the Clintons. Yeah. So in this we're game. we're being paid by the Clinton yeah. Foundation. Mm -hmm. Okay. You at, you're at, the main character is actually the uh, Bill Clinton, the son, the legitimate the, son. The, yeah, the legitimate <laughs> son of Trying to prove Thanks. his worth to his father. <laughs> I mean, though, he looks like him. I'm like not gonna Bill lie. <laughs> the, the 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 guy that says he's Bill Clinton's son. He looks a lot like him. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not gonna jump in on these yeah. conspiracy theories. I'm just well, gonna say. Well, you just did, so you better shut your goddamn mouth. Right, he looks we, nothing we like me. Unlocked here. Sorry, sorry, Bill. God damn it! it Why it, didn't it, I use Tide on the dress? <laughs> Why didn't I use Tide stick? If I did, if I used Tide stick, it would have 100 percent came off. Tide stick, the original, the original. <laughs> okay, but if Tide stick went and made a commercial. <laughs> Where it was like a Bill Clinton impersonator, and, and he's like he like uses a tide. It's like it's like an alternate reality, and they show Bill Clinton using a tide stick, <laughs> on giving the, the come off the dress, and then like that never happens, you know. And he goes on to be just the greatest president of all time. It's like, Dude, see, that'd be so good. They well, would get... I, I, there are a few things that still retract him from being the greatest president on time. Oh, like uh, what, Ryan? What his marriage to Hillary Clinton? Well, like, intro oh. well, no, I, I would say more in line with the, uh, you know. Uh, the laws that made it so if uh, you commit, what, three felonies in a row, you go to jail for life. Um, yes. It's like tic-tac-toe. Who doesn't love tic-tac-toe? <laughs> I mean, his three wife, was it his wife or him that came up with the wonderful term oh. super predator? Uh, no, they came up with super mega, you're thinking of. Oh. Hill, this one's great. Hill, this channel's so funny. 
They're, they're doing a, a voice of me now. Hill, Hill, you gotta come watch these super mega guys. How's Epstein doing? Hill, they got Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> he knew too much about the super mega boys. I'll keep my, uh... Yeah, why'd you have to throw us in there? In the you know, you know uh, it wasn't all the Super Mega Boys. It might have just been one of them. Justin. It, yeah, it was It was Don. It was Don. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, the, the name on the flight logs was not me. It's a different Don. Don, uh, I know that you were coming to see us, but why do you have this weird layover? It, it doesn't make much sense. Well, Don, why do you have a layover in the Virgin Islands? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Why are they doing that voice for me again? It's mean. We did that one with Sonic, didn't we? What? I know I did his voice in the Sonic playthrough at some point. I love doing Don's voice. I think it's pretty accurate, too. Oh. Oh, you would. He got me. Oh. Ooh, find a name is Don. <laughs> Do y'all have any bread pudding? <laughs> any spotted dick? <laughs> Whoa. Part two. Part 12. Episode two. <laughs> Yeah. Whoa. Oh, that's that worked out perfectly. Justin, find that font and recreate that so it's his episode. And, and do the same effects and everything. I'm just kidding, Justin. That's, I mean, if it would be good. Ju for you. How about this, Justin? We'll give you a choice. You can either do that, which would look really cool, or you can do the Fortnite L dance on your green screen. No, I, he, he should. Uh, what yo -yo. should he do? He should get a yo-yo. Get a yo-yo. I could see Justin getting into yo-yo and yeah. like Justin seems like a yo-yo type. Of Justin, he, he could that cheat was me an automatic yo-yo. That was me telling you to do something. That was just some advice. You should get a yo-yo. <laughs> yeah, don't do any edits with the yo-yo. We were just saying that. We so think the choice you is do an edit or go get a yo-yo at some point in your life, Justin. <laughs> There's no wrong. There they're, they're both. Buddy. They're both beneficial, right? Because if he does the edit, that's actually pretty complicated. I imagine some and, text, and he would learn and, like. And if you use a yo-yo, that increases your dopamine levels because you're having so much fun. Yeah. So, uh, so it's almost like doing drugs. Do you guys want to know who these characters are? Yeah, he's about no. to introduce himself. It's, I don't know if it's like a spoiler or not because it doesn't really say in the game, but it's like one of those things that's like, oh. Is one of them Vladdy uh, P? Are they presidents of the United States? All three of them. It's it's uh, Reagan, Nixon, it, it's, it's, and Obama. No, it's <laughs> the id, the... What are those things called? The id? There's like the three different types of someone's personality. It's like yeah. the id, the ego, and the something else. Oh, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I was trying to make a joke about that, you know, but... But you weren't, you're weren't. you not smart enough. I'm not smart enough. See, maybe if you had paid attention more in college. Uh, sorry, I was too busy uh, getting stoned and playing hacky sack. Getting laid, dude? <laughs> Were you getting laid, dude? Uh, dude, I was too busy drinking, drinking No, Ryan. Ling. Why not? I'm not married. Well, I mean, you can have sex no, before... You no, yes, you, you can. can. No, you, you can. can. Yes, you can. It doesn't work. Do you not know the fucking anal loophole that you learned in, like, youth group? Well, that your youth leader My youth would leader teach taught me that when he's like, guys, listen. So you're you, telling me yeah, you commit sodomy on a woman? Well, it's a loophole, yeah. Yeah, it's not gay. The poop hole loophole. Um, do you want to turn to a pillar of salt? Uh, that's only if you look at the gays. You can close your eyes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dude, if you have gay sex but keep your eyes shut, it's not gay. You, you get, it says that you in the Bible. stories of the Bible you like wrong, so it's people? like, she turned around and looked at a gay man and she turned into she a turned pillar of salt. <laughs> That's the reason God turned into salt. Uh, which of these do you boys want me to use? Ooh, Tony. Tony. Tony the tiger. Tony I get the that. Tiger? Fists of furry. I like the things we got you do. Aubrey the pig. Let's Ooh. do Tony. Don Matt wanted Juan. to do Tony. We'll do Tony. All but right. as long as we do a rabbit soon. Okay. I did the rabbit last time. The rabbit's my favorite. Tony's one of my. Least I just favorites. like the so, rabbit. So they have different abilities, right? Can you uh, punch the dogs with Tony? It's like that Twitter so, account. Yeah, Can so you punch the dog? What Tony does is he makes it so your punches kill people. They normally just knock them down. And they're Which, great. It's not. Well, yeah, it's, it's Tony it, the Tiger. Yeah. Get it? Yeah, I get it. Oh, okay, so you can punch the punch. No, the I, have, I have a little knife right now. Watch oh. out for the big old gun. Oh, oh. I, tried, I tried to slice him through the, the through glass. The so I was going to say, this episode, Justin, you could call it pooch punching. Well, you, you can't actually punch. I think you can in two, though, I'm pretty sure, which, like, everyone was so, you know, excited You know about. that Twitter account that's like, can you pet the dog? Yeah. It's just all the different video can games. Can you pet the doge? Can, can, you, can, can you, you pet the pupper? It's like from video games and other shit. Yeah, can you punch the dog? How about that one? Can you fuck the dog? Now that is one I would be interested in. But that's just every theory. every single game. Just every game. It's like no, you cannot fuck the dog. There has to be game. one game. Is is there a dating sim where like you're just talking to dogs except they don't have dialogue? It, it's just dog noises, and you're and you play as like this delusional like uh, 
celebrity on Twitter. That would is be this wonderful. A, is this like a self? What? Like, is this go based on? on something? Oh. What's the joke? Well, you said delusional celebrity on Twitter. Yeah. Who, who are you talking about? Who am I talking about? Oh, I know who you're talking about. Okay, never mind. I see. I thought you were talking about yourself for a second. Of course. What? Come here, sucker. What was her name? I don't even want, want uh, to say Well, it's her, her and there's was... some other person. There's a lot of people that fuck animals. Y'all should not fuck dogs or okay, any animal. Okay, hold on there. Just wait, wait a second. W what, if we, what if there's a dog listening? Like, dogs now, Dogs have a right to choose who they have sex with, Matthew. What are you? Are you trying to say you're like a Republican Party member trying to choose if a woman can what a woman can do with her body you don't think a dog has control oh, no. of their own body there's gotta be like one dude out there it's like ryan's right they have self-autonomy dude ryan's they can't just be slaves dogs we gotta play we gotta please them as much as they please us i know we do I, we absolutely do would you do i miss hey F philip defranco i know you're watching he episode us. two of hotline man he doesn't follow us yeah he does does he follow super mega or like our personal accounts oh i don't know oh you know i just have some people following me sorry <laughs> i i can i can dm him if you want ryan tell, tell him what you said tell him you miss him well I, well you you've actually met him though that's right we did get, play pokemon and we saw him at a party once together. too remember we were ryan we actually uh ryan dms him a lot trying to get him to hang out as well yeah, he it, it doesn't work. He he's too busy, apparently. That's what he says. Sucker. I mean, I, I can't imagine doing like a news show because you just always oh. have to be like ready to ready for action, right? It's yeah. Like there's no break from that because it's the news. Poor guy. I know, man. He he he's he's doing what we all should be doing, but can't because we're not strong enough. Yes. Sexy Phil has the oh. he has the. Uh, that's the word I'm looking for. The strength. The diligence. The the, the do All diligence. Right. The I'm hair. Sorry. He has nice hair. The face. I do like Philip DeFranco a lot. I think I Oh, think... why don't you marry him? What the hell, dude? When's was... the last time you watched a full one of his videos, Matt? Or, Quite or some part time. one of his videos. <laughs> he's just one of those guys that like What, are you gonna say something negative now? No, I was gonna say he's one of those guys up. that like you just everyone kinda knows and he's just kinda likable. You know like, like Boogie, right? Yeah. Speak, I, speaking of which, while we're on the subject, I can explain to you guys why I need a Tesla for my company car. Because <laughs> it would give you time to practice this game on the road. Yeah, I'd be able to, you know, pull out my uh, PlayStation Vita and play. Well, Jackson, you've made a very good point, actually. And I think the patrons would really actually be very happy if we Look, spent the if, money on that. If we can get to 10,000 patrons, we'll celebrate by getting Jackson a Tesla. Woo! That's a lot of money. What is? 10,000 patrons. So is a Tesla, I'm just saying. Though if we reach 10,000 patrons, we do have you, no choice but to get do you think Jackson we, a Tesla. Would we ever hit that point, 10,000 patrons? How many patrons do we have right now? About 6,000. Well, that's only 4,000 more. We're already over halfway there. Fuck. The, 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 the reason we're not, we're, not, we're not climbing up is, is because of... Uh, content that is yet to be released on this channel which then makes it hard for us to release content on patreon yeah but hopefully by the time this is out we've been we've been better at that or maybe it's just well after australia and tour those are the big last things that we gotta do this year and then it's it's really we're gonna fucking pump out content like back like, in 2017 <laughs> okay guys after we get back from christmas we promise <laughs> i gotta say you're you're not you're not doing too too oh. shabby remember that guy down there he's gonna have that fucking gun they're gonna be two of these suckers what? Ooh, 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 oh. ooh, 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 ah. ah. I sounded like a monkey there. I, I, ooh, 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 ah. Yesterday I saw for the first time how Gibbons monkeys look when they do that, uh. Oh, that, oh, 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 I oh, didn't know they got that oh, big oh, ball oh, in their oh, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, oh. You're really good at that. At the, uh, the Riverbank Zoo is where you can hear them a shit ton back in, uh, Columbia, South Carolina. That's, your monkeys are... It's annoying as hell with the sounds they make. It's like they'll just be ho hooting and hollering. It's like, why y'all doing that? You're in a zoo. Stop. I mean, you and I could be loud if we wanted to, but we're we're not at all times. I know. We can be very chill. You think monkeys can just be like? <laughs> they do. They're pretty low a, a lot of the times. Like a, like a like a soft cooing. Yeah. You know? 
By the way, I I played a Jackson and I played a little bit of uh, Ancestors, oh, oh, Human. Oh. What is it called? Human. I don't know. Odyssey. Whatever Detroit that. become human. <laughs> no. Um, that is that monkey game. Haha. <laughs> uh, it's the evolution uh, one. Yeah, that one, and it was bad. I didn't like it. That's disappointing. I I, I wanted a fun monkey. I game. really liked the idea of that game. Okay, I, I don't want to say it's horrible because they're definitely maybe it's just not worse for us. games. Yeah, maybe it's just not. Or maybe also what we expected from it. We got too excited about just the fact that See, there were monkeys. Yeah, I care too much. I wanted much. a fun game. We need a monkey game, though. We need, like, I, honestly, I think the best game idea is, is Grand Theft Auto, but I, it's with monkeys. I was talking to Justin uh, last night, and I was just saying, how much fun would you have in Grand Theft Auto? Like, here's the, here's the premise, right? You start off in a zoo, and then you escape from the zoo. And you know how in the beginning of every open world game, you think of like, not every open world game, but stuff uh, like it, like Saints Row and Grand there, Theft Auto, the first mission is to, man, you need to get yourself some new clothes. You know, yeah. that type of shit? You do that. Monkey, you need to get yourself new clothes. Yeah, the monkey needs to get new clothes. He goes and ramsacks a J.C. Penny. Yeah, he goes and gets some new clothes so he's in disguise, or, so people or, can't tell who he is. maybe he needs to go to the Banana Republic. <laughs> Man, that was funny as fuck. Thank you. Ryan, but the, here's the thing. Last night, we were talking on our way to Tiki Tuesday, and you said, how much fun, like, I, I wish that they had made, like, Monkey GTA, and I said, but Ryan, here's the thing. You can oh, make this. fuck me. It's good they didn't make it, because no one's made it, which means we can make well, it's that. The same, it would like, be too, it would be too much. I'd want it to be, like, very high quality. Well, we'd have to hire a team. Model. It would be, like... I, I, if I was a billionaire, 100%, I'd, I'd hire a team instead right of away like to get funding research and like uh, like helping like no, six monkey children. GTA. It's like, like I'm putting all my money to fund Monkey GTA. Like you would. Like, are you gonna if you become a billionaire, Matt? Are you gonna you gonna put out all of your earnings into chair charitable outcomes? Um, shit? Oh, of course not. I can't get the guy's gun. I'm gonna buy myself a, a Lamborghini. Of course. Uh, Why buy, a Lamborghini? Uh, just because it's it's a nice. Is it your favorite sports car? No. Then why why'd you say Lamborghini? Because it's just the go-to sports car to mention. Lambo's oh, so you're just a you, you were just saying shit to say shit. No, I, it's because of Bam Margera has a purple Lamborghini. You know who else has a purple Lamborghini? Rick, Ricky Rose. <laughs> Rick Ross and Skrillex. Does purple he? Lamborghini, purple Lamborghini lurking. From Suicide Squad. Is, is that an original track? It is from, from Suicide, Suicide Squad. Squad. They say it in the song. They go Such Suicide a good song. Squad. It's Skrillex and Rick Ross. I was thinking we could actually do a, f a fan video for that. Yeah, um, I like, think that would be good. Where I can be Jared Leto's Joker. Ryan, you can be the uh, Will Smith's character. I don't think I could. No, you could be. Uh, what's the guy? I don't no, think the I'd Killer be Croc. To. Killer Croc. I think Ryan would be. Good I don't think I could. I don't think I also could be Killer Croc. At least not in that in that universe is Killer Croc. Well, this is the super mega universe. Okay, so it's not okay. So I'm not trying to be the Suicide Squad movies Killer Croc. Yeah, no, you're just gonna be Killer Croc because he was played by a certain actor that I don't think I could replicate his appearance. Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> I just looked up how many chapters there are. Are there a lot? I'm not gonna spoil it, but uh. No, you can say. We're we're a. Uh, it's a it's a longer. We're, game. we're a fourth through the game. Okay, there's 20 chapters. After beating this level, there's 20 chapters. Or after beating this chapter, yeah. All right. Wait, did you did you graduate high school too? Yes, I did. Oh, I did a little math. My Ooh. man, my my brother. Y'all seen that new trailer for uh, Bad Boys for Life? What you gonna do? With, Wait, with, with Will Smith and and Martin Lawrence. If there's a new Bad Boys movie? Yeah, and everyone's ma everyone's clowning Martin Lawrence because he gained gained a bit of weight. Oh, there's still somebody down here. When you get older, your metabolism slows hell? down. People are real oh. mean. They're like, wow, he really looks like Big Mama now. It's like, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Have you ever seen Big Mama? Of course, one and two. I have, I never have. I wasn't allowed to watch those movies. Because of the types of... Yeah, my, my dad wasn't. Yeah. He wouldn't let me. Okay. I, uh, I, I, I always wanted to, because I remember going to the video store as a, as a child and seeing the cover, oh. and I was like... <laughs> What's the Well as a kid I just thought that like Big Mama's house was like the the black version of uh what's it called Miss Doubtfire <laughs> Yeah dude I mean it, it's crazy in South Carolina just like how much casual racism there is <laughs> I mean everywhere it Sounds like something that should be fun but it's, but isn't
Yo, yo, it's crazy how much casual racism. You know, I, I, I casually do a lot of things, but racism definitely. Racism is one I I'm more, of a, I'm, I'm more of a casual racist. You know, I'm not like a like a hardcore one. I'm just kind of casual. <laughs> I wouldn't describe myself as a racist, but from time to time, you know, it's, I'm, I'm casual <laughs> with the racism. Look at you, man. What, what, did, what did you get? What do you think? An A? An A plus? A something. A oh, plus, oh. baby. Playstyle executioner. My man. You know, I'm gonna. We're gonna have to go watch Big Mama's house tonight. Are we? Yeah. No. Uh, I'm just kidding. I got a hot date with my hand. <laughs> it's a masturbation joke. I don't, by the way. Matt, odds are you have to masturbate to uh, a scene that I pick out for you from Big Mama's House 1 or 2. You have to masturbate to it, to completion. Well, how do I prove that the completion thing? Do I need to send you, like, a picture? Do you need to watch me masturbate? You, you have to send well, me You, have to, you have to it, send me a cum, cum tribute of Big Mama. Well, now you're, you're changing it up now. Okay. At first it was I need to masturbate to a scene. Now it's I need to masturbate to a scene <laughs> and finish how, it with a cum tribute How about you can do either one? <laughs> Yeah, um, either either or. You pick your poison. A contribute or to one of the scenes. Because here's the thing. I think it's going to be harder to get off while watching Big Mama, but I won't have that lasting physical... Because, like... No, I want you to masturbate to Big Mama. Yeah. Like, yeah. the movie or Big Mama specifically? So, so Martin Lawrence dressed <laughs> the, the up movie, as Big Mama. The movie. I'll, 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 like, choose a scene, and I'll make a video for you, or I'll get a bunch of compilations and shit, make a video for you. And you and you might have to replay it a few times, but you have to masturbate to completion while watching it. You can't watch anything else. You can't have anything else around. Well, let me throw this cheat. out there. I already have a very hard time masturbating because I take. Then, then I, this should then I, this I should help you out. This, this should, should be help. Fun. You. Yeah. I don't really have a sex drive to begin with. That's like hard mode for masturbation. It is. Um, or not hard mode. Essentially, yes. So how about, well actually, I did lose one of the odds where I had to masturbate to this one video Jackson I found on YouTube where it's just like a bunch of like clips, like <laughs> compressed clips of women twerking and there's like EDM music and then just with Windows Movie Maker they're putting titles that are like, wouldn't Ooh, you yeah. like to touch that ass? Don't come yet! And it was like a don't come challenge, but it was on YouTube and I still, if you can find me that video, I, I still have to do that. Okay. You still have to take a hit out of a out of a dirty bong too. And uh, don't you have to masturbate to Chris Chan? Don't you have to get a certain tattoo, Ryan? No. Why not? What do you mean? What, what? tattoo? The uh, the my name is Jeff waveform. What was that from? See, now he's pretending like he's never heard of it. Mm. It's documented, Ryan. It's documented. Where? On Super Mega. Show me the proof. Ryan, I'm the not proof gonna, is in the pudding. And there's too many videos. Ooh, do we have pudding? Yeah. <laughs> oh, did somebody say pudding? Hey, Ryan, what are the odds you have to go buy me some pudding right now? Haha. Well, <laughs> well uh, uh, I'll I'll do that, but Matt. I need to do the Big Mama one first. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll do it. You know what? Ten. I'll do that. At ten. Three, two, one, seven. seven. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I'll make the video for you, and uh, you have to. <laughs> yep. Jackson, you have to. You have to keep them. Well, I'm not gonna be there. No, of course not. But like, we need to, find... to monitor. But it would be easy for him to just lie and text me and say, "Hey, I just masturbated to Big." So Mama. You, you want me to watch? Is that I, my I job want you to. I, well, he's gonna go into his room. Think of think of it as the job I pay you for, Jackson. <laughs> um, basically, I, I want you to be there at least while he's doing it, not in the no, room. No, what the fuck? Not in the room. Okay, do you expect me I to don't be able to get off if, if my friend is there? I mean, he's. I'm sure you've masturbated before when y'all have been in the same, like, living quarters. Never. No, not in the same, like, room. <laughs> Since it's not, I didn't say the same room. In the same, uh, just to make sure that he can knock and be like, are you done? Oh, are you yeah. done, mister? Hey, well, buddy. let's, let's wait until Jackson's mom is not staying with us. Let's, I, I, pre I preferably like to, you know. Do you think I can trust you, Matt, without having yes. Jackson as a referee? No, absolutely, ab like. I, if I, I will, make the video for you, I legitimately will. I still have to read to that this. Rolling Stones magazine. You do have to read that Rolling Stones magazine. <laughs> I have to read all of it. That's a big. That's like a ninety-page magazine on the Rolling Stones. God, what if I can't find oh. it? What if it's gone forever? Then, then you, uh, then you have to jerk me off to then, Big then Mama. You have to find <laughs> <laughs> the big one that I can never do that you still bring up was like from five years ago, and it was a. Uh, I had to take a shit off of that bridge in Columbia that has a, uh, a road underneath it. Yeah, you do. No, I can't. That's that's like that's like a felony. Well, Matt, you lost the word of the odds. 
you know, if you don't have integrity, that's one thing, but then, you know, can I, what can I trust you with them? That's true. That's true. Are okay. your hands getting sweaty? Oh, yeah. I can blow on them if you want. I mean, you tried once and... Well, I can, I, I do a better job this time. Okay, let's see it. See, that's good. He's blowing on him. Hey, Ryan. Yeah. He, I just got a pretty good blow job. Oh, I did not see that one coming. <laughs> oh, oh fuck. man. That one didn't suck. Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. Nice going, jackass. I don't get it. Oh, it's not a part of the. Got it. Never mind. Next time. Next time. Uh. When Jackson's a bad little employee, we're gonna call him Jackass instead of Jackson. I mean, how about Smokes Crackson? Oh, I forgot. You, you gotta shoot those suckers. Shoot those. Ooh, Ooh. He, he gets you in one old punch, doesn't he? Yes. So sir. what's the giraffe special ability? So I was showing that off a little bit. He can uh, look farther. So he oh, can, I can see. Because he has such a long neck. That's yeah, so cool. exactly. I love this game so much. It's so cool. Oh, then why, why don't you marry it? Why don't you shut the fuck up? Jackson, your attitude is... is you, you really want to speak this way to your employers? When you say up there, is that a good way or a bad way? A bad way. Oh, okay. Like negative. Matt and Ryan what? abused their staff. Only Justin. Just Justin. I hope Justin I was get the good treatment. Justin's just sitting as... Why?! Ah! Like, legit, it's not cool! Mom, they said it again! They're joking about me in the Let's Play! And yeah, what is he gonna do? Complain about us sending him free shit? Yeah, oh, sorry. Sorry you got a, a nice ass hula hoop in the mail and a tiny drum set, Justin. And uh, a nice yeah. male masturbatory tool. Which you, what am I supposed to do with it, Justin? It's self explanatory. It, it's, does it come with instructions? It comes with two <laughs> orifices, that's oh, all it needs. Like, what if Justin actually, like, legitimately, like, actually didn't know what he's like, what, no, but really, what do I do with this? <laughs> well, Justin, you stick your hand in it. And then uh, you wear it as a glove, and then you masturbate with it. That's good. I need a weapon to break up. Why doesn't Justin put a video of him using that item we sent him in? <laughs> don't, Justin. I mean, I, I don't feel like I have to he tell you. He can give it to his to. dog as a chew toy. I'm sure a dog would love that. I'm sure it smells great, too. Like, pocket pussies... Like the Holy cheap, shit. the cheap ones have that nasty yeah. like Chinese rubber smell. You know on Amazon how you can get like new, but you can go to the option of used or whatever. Can you get like one of those that's like like new? I'm gonna might have to do a little research real quick <laughs> just to see. I feel like there's some items like you can't resell. I mean, but if it's like new, that's true. If it's like new, let's see. Um. What would be disgusting is if you found, like, one on eBay. I, I bet there's pocket pussies on you, but they'll say they're not open. But you know they were. Oh, open. do you remember? It was, it's very famous. It, it was one of those very famous, like, 4chan lore things where the guy found a pocket pussy Job, in his, like, new house that he moved into. And it was, like, moldy and was old and had, like, old cum in it. And, uh... That's what I told you about the one that you found in my room, too. Yeah. I was like, oh, that must have been when we moved in. Huh? <laughs> But he put his dick in it. Oh shit! Like he, he like, like people dared him on 4chan, so he uh, put his penis in the, in the pocket pussy, the old one. Ugh. Yeah, that's just not. There's, there's some things you just shouldn't do. He did. We're on 212 North 24th Street, Northeast 24th Street. Dressed to kill. See ya. Click. Dressed to kill, Jackson. Oh, I will. I'm, I'm gonna go and cosplay. <laughs> As, the, as Harley Quinn. I want to be one of those I'm guys not... who, like, wears... Well, I guess this game doesn't have an iconic jacket, but, like, wears the drive jacket out everywhere he goes, and he's like, yeah. He's not I like cosplay. movies. <laughs> oh, we should do an odds are with Harrison that he has to, he has drive to wear drive on oh, his God. motorcycle. That would make him so mad. Okay. <laughs> Imagine we'll Harrison, like, it's like... the first... No, no, he has to wear it during his drive... Like, his motorcycle driver's test. Oh, my test. God, yes. <laughs> yes, yes that's Can I call him right now and do yeah. that? Yeah. yeah, yeah do Dude, that. Would he do it, or would he be like, ha-ha? I, 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 I think he'd do it. No, he'd do he, it. He, he commits pretty, pretty good to one of the odds. Granted, have to get the jacket for him, probably, but we can just land, like, an even cheap one that's, like, a knockoff of it. And then maybe, also, he can put up his Pulp Fiction post up in his room. Oh yeah. Well, you mean the one that you bought and is on the ground in your room? Dude, they don't even start that rumor. Uh, that, that's not a rumor, Matt. Normally I do this bit where I act like it's a rumor. I don't have a Pulp Fiction poster. Hello? 
Isn't it Japanese? I don't. I don't. No, oh, I don't have a Pulp Fiction poster. It's it's just now ringing. Do you want me to turn the TV down? Uh, Maybe. I don't know. He might not even answer. He better. <sighs> Hello. Hey. Uh, sorry to call you and interrupt your day. Are you are you doing well so far, today? Okay, that's fine. That's good. Uh, well, we were, we just came up with an odds are for you that I think would just be too perfect to pass up and let us forget. So would you mind if I asked you? Go ahead. Okay, odds are you have to wear the drive jacket when you complete your motorcycle driver's test. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> That's up to you. That's, That's up to you. Buddy. That's up to you. Uh, 25, okay. 3, 2, 1, 23. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, you're well, free. Did you tell him what I have to do? Oh, oh <laughs> Matt has a good Hey, I, Harrison, I, I get the pleasure of being able to masturbate to a scene from Big Mama's house, one <laughs> or two. We can get it for him as a gift. Anyway, <laughs> that is true. We Congratulations get... for getting your bike, buddy. No, I have an idea. I have a really good one of the odds. I don't know if he'd let us do it, but it's like next time he has like a first date over, he, he lets us get to decorate his room before, and he doesn't get to see it, or, and he can't tell her. <laughs> yes. So oh, so we could put up like some really cringy posters and shit. But we wouldn't go like way no, overboard no, no, no. with it. We make it look like a Honestly, legitimate room. No, we could just put like one thing. I think that's almost funnier if it's like one su subtle, we but very put up, We each get we to put up, we each get to put up one, one item. item. Like something like that would just be kind of embarrassing for a 26 year old man who's bringing a, like a, like a Steven Universe poster. Like, <laughs> yes. Which is nothing wrong with Steven Universe. Why not a Wizards of Waverly Place poster? That would just because he can play that off as like, oh, it's ironic, and it's funny. But that, uh, that's also not Doctor Harrison's Who. Doctor not if Who. we get it signed. Ooh, Do Doctor Who is good. Oh god. I mean, we have the signed Bill Cosby frame picture. Yeah, we I'm just gonna put, put that, that in up. there. That alone will make his day leave. So, so why do you have a signed picture of a rapist on your wall? <laughs> it's it's I'm it's, an, it's, I'm I'm an, an irony, irony bro. bro. <laughs> so it's, it's ironic. This is from February of this year from USA Today. Bill Cosby having amazing experience in jail. Likens himself to MLK. Did he do that? <laughs> Bill, he might have a couple screws loose up there. I dude, I bet he's like the fucking godfather of that prison. What about Bill Clintby and it's Bill Cosby and Bill Clinton mixed together? Bill Clintby? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bill Clintby. Bill. <laughs> what? What? Uh. What would their voices together sound like? <laughs> I'm gonna let you try that one. All right, I'm gonna give it a go. Um. Come on. I did not have sexual relations. No, that was really bad. I need to. Okay, I need to do them both individually. <laughs> I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Okay, that's a good Bill Cosby. And no. <laughs> I did not that but the the pill into the, the pudding pop. So if you mix them together, it's like I did not have sexual relations with that woman. I don't know. I think that that's, was good enough. Yeah, that's, that's tricky good. to that's combine good. them. Like you know, they're so different that it's. Thank you. Guys. Ah! Damn. Okay, now now we starting for real. Okay, now okay, we starting now, for real. Now we starting for real. <laughs> now we're starting this time, for real. All right, I'm you just throw just, it a little uh, bit earlier, buddy. Hey, I'm not your buddy, pal. I'm not your pal, guy. I'm not your guy, friend. I like I like pink stuff. Ah, oh, shit. You're a brave shit. soul. <laughs> Dude, tough guys wear pink. Can we can we start wearing those shirts and say like only tough guys wear pink? Only tough guys this is wear your pastel shirts. colors in California. Can yeah. we just do a mega shirt that's one of those this is your girlfriend shirts? Yeah, of course. Yeah. But first, we need to sell the the jaw shirt that just says penis on it. The jaw shirt. <laughs> oh! It, it's just XXX. It's XXX it's and tossing yeah. underwater, like looking up, and it says oh. jaw, jaws. That's good. You know. Jaw also, jaw is the word for God in Rasta in like the the Rastafarian religion. Was did you ever see the Expendables, Ryan? I did. I saw Expendables one and good? two. <laughs> is, do you think like I'd like it since I like John Wick so much? <laughs> it's not like John Wick when ah. it comes to entertainment, because John Wick is like, you can legitimately like it. I think if you were going to like Expendables, it would all be ironic. Every ounce of it would be ironic. Is Expendables the old people? Yeah. Sylvester Stallone. Sylvester Stallone. Terry Crews. Didn't they make like Arnold five of them? They, they made they like got a bunch. Harrison Ford. You know, I'm gonna make you an offer. Liam you can't Hemsworth. Do dumb dumb Froth. What's the Russian dude? That oh, was shit. In, what's his name? Dolph Lungen. What's his name? Dolph Lundgren. D what did I say? Dolph. You Lundgren. said Dolph Lungen. <laughs> <laughs> Dolph Lungen. I, my name is Dolph Lungen. 
<laughs> Dude, that's such a good name. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dalph Lung. <laughs> Oh, that's, that's good. That's some good shit. <coughs> you should legally change your name so then you're like, I'm Dalph Lungan. Ryan, what do you have to change your name to Dalph Lungan? Uh, oh, yeah. uh, legally? No, find, Ill illegally. You have to illegally change your name to Dalph Lungan. <laughs> you have to find one of those guys that makes you in, I have to break into like a, a government store. It's funny because what, what, like uh, a store <laughs> where they the change your where name. You can buy store. a new name there. <laughs> yeah. Shop for a new name. They have them hanging up. Hey Matt. Yeah. I want to see if if you get it right. I'm gonna do. There's two things that I'm gonna ask you. I'm gonna see if you can get the right answer that I have in my head. And okay. So basically, it's it's called what what song plays when a minority when a certain minority comes on screen. So let's act like someone from a uh, uh, a Latin background. You know, yeah, comes on screen. What would be the go-to music? Let's say a group of, well, I don't know, uh, people. Uh, let's say Mexican or Spanish. You know, it's it's. Now, are we, are we doing like a specific song or like just this genre of music? Well, Hollywood kind of groups them all together, anyways. So there's one song in particular Is that I'm Rider? thinking of. No, 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 not no. Lowrider. No, when you when you think of like oh the I'll just put it this way like when Hollywood is like oh or a, a, an Adam Sandler movie an da, 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 yep there it is that one and then what happens when an Asian comes on screen? There's two things that could happen. I, I, I not they don't really do the gong anymore. It could have been. I, I know what it is. But I'm you not know, gonna you, say you it. You know what it is? Yeah. It's not the the little jingle, right? It is the jingle. Yeah. Da, 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 I mean, they, da, 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 they don't do that da, 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 da. still. That was, no. also, that was written by a by a white dude too. That's not even from China. Oh, Buck Owens. <laughs> My transistor radio comes from far away. Buck Cherry away. wrote that. <laughs> <laughs> I wish Buck Cherry wrote that. <laughs> oh. What Damn. happens when a white person comes on screen? <laughs> the devil went down in Georgia. He was looking for a soul to steal. Okay, what happens when a, uh, oh, what happens when uh, a movie character, the scene changes to when they're, like, deserted in the desert? Like that kind of, like, twangy. What am I thinking? Like, think, like, an, like an Arabian desert. It's usually people that are like, yeah, exactly. Like, oh, Coca-Cola. <laughs> they hide like brand deals in there. Yeah. Coca-Cola. <laughs> Refresh. <laughs> Enjoy. Uh, Try to think of other like things that movies do where it's like. Uh, tell stories. Uh, show character development. Entertain the masses, and if you're the movie Big Mama's House, you bring me to orgasm. <laughs> well, not yet. You still have yet to co complete that. I mean, it's you know, only been to fit w before we finish this series. There will have been a break because we will. You have gotta do a. Oh, Matt. Do I need to do it in Australia? What, what are the odds that you do it on the flight to Australia? <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, oh go. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not joining the Mile High Club with myself. Why not? And Marlon, no. Mar Marlon, Marlon uh, Brando. You and Marlon Brando. Uh, Brando uh, did some naughty things on a movie set. Really? Yeah. He had sex with uh, what's his face? Allegedly. Oh yeah, he yeah. What's his face? Will Smith. No, him and uh, another actor, um, very famous actor, singer, had sex a lot. I think. Gene Kelly. Gene, who's Gene Kelly? Roseanne. You don't know who Gene Kelly is? Marlon Brando and Roseanne, always hitting the sack together. I'm singing, getting brain. <laughs> I'm singing, getting brain. What a glorious feeling. That's a good song. That's classic. I'm coming again to Big Mama's house. <laughs> oh, whoa. What's that movie where it's like, am I in Groundhog Day or does Jackson suck at this game? Uh, I think I might be B uh, Bob Marley in Groundhog Day right now. <laughs> <laughs> That was good. What's his name? Bill. No, Bill it's Murray. Bob Marley. <laughs> yeah, it's I don't. Bill I don't know why I forgot his name. Bill for Murray's a name. Yeah, he, I mean he lived in your side of town. What, what about Charleston? Brain Murray? <laughs> That's oh, good. Who, who hit the HDMI? That was my 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 mistake. It'll go away in a second. It is a mistake. That part you got right. I know, dude. I'm I'm owning up to it too. You're owning the libs with it. <laughs> 
Oh. They're very similar. La cucaracha, la cucaracha. Oh man, I'm a. Do you need silence and concentration? No, no, no. We can give you that. I, I prefer without silence. Do you mean are your hands sweaty? You mean to blow on your hands? I do like the hand blowing. Okay. I'll give you a hand this job or a blow job. Ooh, They're the same thing. Well, he just died again, Matt. So you gotta get to blowing. Harder. Don't get spit on his hands. I'm not spitting on his hands. Uh, I'm a little lightheaded now. I haven't had much to eat today, so. I haven't had much to eat in the last week. Just kind of been it, why don't busy you? working and not taking care of myself. I would hang out closer to the other side. And yeah. It might give you a little more time to the left. Yeah. That might give me a little more room. Oh, yeah. See, there you go. See, I got, I got a little bit of gamer yeah, knowledge. You, you, you're picking that up. I'm a. Uh, ooh. Oh. Man, these guys are just locked and loaded. Relentless. <sighs> don't mind if I beat off over here real quick? I mean, you gotta save it for Big Mama's house. That's true, I don't wanna waste my, uh, you wanna waste my male juices. vitality. I only have so much of it in my system. And then we, uh, we're gonna auction off the paper that- you, did that guy <laughs> just, that guy just run through the wall? Out the wall? See that glitch? Yeah. Dude, I was watching some, uh, Flintstones yesterday in the office. As Working I always hard, do. Yeah. You were. What was the plot of that one? Uh, Frankenstein moved next door to the Flintstones. <laughs> it, it was a good plot, you know? Classic, man. Can, can we do, like, the typical, like, monster episode of that, but for Super Mega, like... I don't know, Dracula moves in next to the Super Megaplex. <laughs> but he's a big fan. Like, instead of, like, my mom's <laughs> dating a vampire, it's like our landlord's a vampire. <laughs> well, with the way they're sucking us dry... Aaron Hansen's a vampire. Confirmed. I think he might be, man. I could see Danny uh, being into like van vampiric. <laughs> Just make this hair grow, so I don't have to wear a wig anymore. Guys, seriously, the jokes are not funny. Stop. We're just jokes are only on funny if I make fun of someone else. If someone makes fun of me, it's too far and it hurts my self-esteem. I, I I do love clowning on our good friend Danny. But he doesn't watch Super. Brian likes it. Brian actually gave us permission to do these jokes. Yeah. I, they both ran through the wall. About again. Danny. Yeah. I asked him, and he explicitly said yes, and I have I have receipts to prove that. He was you like, know, yes. fans are gonna send him like, look what the boys said about you. What? That he wears a wig? Yeah. Well. And then he's gonna stop being. It's our not friends. slander if it's true, though. That is true. That's the that's the thing. What if Danny actually took you to court for wearing a wig, but like? The day before we like put Nair in his shampoo, so we like lose. His <laughs> <laughs> that's dirty. That's that's dirty. That's goofy. I, I that would be. I, I think if I we should do that jackass style prank. We walk up to Danny from behind with a razor and just. <laughs> he would have to shave his head. No, he wouldn't. No, he could hide it. it. It's the new era of ninja sex party. Danny bald man. Danny <laughs> sex bald. Do you think? Uh, Brian, sorry, Ninja Brian is gonna want full credit at one point and just go full like Ninja Brian whacked. Ninja Brian, and like it's, he's gonna show. take off the mask. Oh, so like, like he wants more credit, so he just goes by his full name, Ninja <laughs> Brian whacked, and he, and he doesn't wear the mask anymore. Ah. Wait, why does he wear the mask? <laughs> because he's the hero. He's the hero we need, but not the one we deserve. Uh, imagine that movie where Bane is just uh, Ninja Brian. <laughs> <laughs> And they're expecting uh, two of us in the wreckage, brother. How do I do this? Stinky <laughs> butthole and farts. <laughs> Hashtag penis. <laughs> Who does Danny play? Hashtag <laughs> butt sex. Ha <laughs> ha. Danny's two faced, but like half of them has the wig on. And half of them it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good, man. Danny, you're better than this. He like flip. He flips a coin. Half of the coin just like fuzzy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh man. Damn, dude. Ah, uh, you were pony noobs right there. Talk about Hotline Miami. Hotline my Danny. <laughs> wow. Oh my God. You know, Danny needs a after after we're dogging on him, he needs a little self and not self encouragement. He needs encouragement from others. So here's his number on screen. Damn. This is a. Uh... <laughs> right over there fell asleep. I think. Wait, were you asleep? I might have been. I thought you were just watching in silence. Might have been nodding off. Ryan, Justin put this in. Ryan actually just did take a little nap. 
Because I like Ryan didn't say anything for like ten minutes. Straight. I know. I was like, am I being that bad at this game? <laughs> I mean, yes, but oh fuck this. It's. I mean, it's it's a hard level. It's getting hotter in here. It too. is. It is. The heat always makes me do worse at games. And then Ryan was just like, just nodded off. Just just fell a little asleep. You you need to go home and get some rest, buddy. I probably do. Need to drink a shit ton of water. Drink have it. myself a decent dinner. Have a have a good Gotta healthy dinner. Got a wash and uh, take a shower. Go go get bed early. Go get Gotta better. shop for clothes that fit me. Bro, I need to shop for clothes. We can go clothes shop. You guys want to go clothes shop too. tomorrow? Maybe. I'm down. If you boys need to, we can uh, you know hit up the Gondo Gallery or something. Hit up. How about we hit up the Ganja Gallery, right? <laughs> I like we just. Oh. oh. Boom. Good, good, good. Oh, I'm. Oh, Lord. Jesus Christ! I'm so. Oh, oh, run! 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 run. <laughs> oh. Oh. Come on, just one guy with a gun. You got a good. You like, know what stops a good guy with a gun, though? <laughs> a bad guy wait. with a gun. You know, oh, there's wait. only one thing that can stop a good guy with a doing? gun. Nice. He's kind of glitching out, so. He's done. Yes! He's done for. Woo. My boy, you got methodical. We did it. Do you, you, know? what, do you think it's, uh, it's a coincidence that after touching Ryan's gooch sweat on your first try, you beat that level? That's a very Did you good die point. once after touching my no. gooch? No. Once, once it was on his hand, that's on the controller. And there's the eye, there's no eye in team. <sighs> Fellas, we just. Uh... Well, if you were to spell it phonetically, yeah. Nice. Was that was that the end? Let's. Oh. Nope. <laughs> Not the end. Almost though. Let's see it. Let's see it, buddy. Okay. Three hundred PTS. What's PTS stand for? Uh, Post traumatic stress. So look how much PTS you're getting. You don't have the disorder yet. You can, if you get too many of those points, then you will. Okay. Well, we don't have to worry then, because I Did won't. Did you like how I, I explained it and ended, end, ended it at the yeah, same time? Yeah. Yeah. Did you actually not know what PTS meant? No, I get the point. Yeah. But did you originally not know? Yeah, what no, I knew. I knew it stands for points. Okay, sure. I mean, point total score is what it stands for. Nice, Jackson. Next time you die, can you just give the controller to Matt? I just want to oh. see. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I, I'm. I'd be down to do that. All right, Matt, your turn. My turn. Feel how sweaty that controller. That's is. a moist control. This is a nice Xbox controller. Thank you. Okay. What are the controls? Um, R1 is to shoot, L1 is to throw your weapon. Or if you have a weapon, R1 is to... Okay. Ah, uh, let's watch this. Okay. Can we get a... Stupid! Okay, um, I bet that's can enough. Can we get one song in the background for like a compilation of that? He doesn't, he doesn't the, want to do it anymore. That's, that's all I can do. I mean, that's a slippery controller, too. I mean, that's probably why I was dying so much, because there was so much... Are the grips already just... Just, uh... Just worn away, off yeah. By, by Jackson's fingers? It was like, uh... If I put a little chess piece in some some fryer oil and pulled it out, that's what it felt like. Just just cover a controller. Sounds like with my gooch area Ooh. right now. Could I could I? Maybe Jackson just needs to refresh his finger and touch it again. It definitely. I mean, you could just go in my pants and slime your way through my thighs. Jackson, you could get a little get a good, uh, get, a, get some good uh, controller lubricant. Yeah, if you need some gamer goo. <laughs> that's what that's what the uh, pros call it, gamer goo. You always see like during a Fortnite competition, them reaching. Sponsored their... by Gamer Goo. Oh, they just go <sighs> lather their controller up with it. Nice, that was very good. All right, watch out, cause I don't know where there's if there's other good? guys. Oh, it's just those shit. guys now, right? Oh fuck! It's just those guys. Twenty-four rounds right there. Jackson. They're gonna shoot up right when you cross though, cause they can see you through the glass, right? Jackson has to focus. Oh, yeah, just, okay, just, just a bat. And there's one a guy with a gun. Oh, 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 yes. Good job. Good job, Jackson. And Good job, Jackson. Uh-oh. Woo! Woo! Good job, Ryan. Everyone's doing stuff over here. But me. Chapter clear, brother. Yeah, Look at that. I'd if you stepped it up, Matt. What do you want me to do? I don't know, just something. You got, you got Jackson playing. You know, I'm, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm doing funny farts. You what do you do, Matt? Uh, I, I I'm falling short here, so apologies. What? Oh, that time bonus. I guess that could be your thing. What? Apologize. Apologies. I could do apologies. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm so sorry. <laughs> 
B plus. <laughs> in every in every super mega. Uh, ooh, there we ooh! go. Willem and Jay. Yes. Oh what hell fun. yeah! Oh, I'm so excited about that. Ooh, and an Uzi. And a ooh, I like the Uzi. I, I like the sprite of the guy with the All Uzi. Right, okay. After, uh, well, we we have to get through the. Uh, this is still a part of the level, technically, so we won't come back here. So okay, what are you looking at? That guy looks like fucking, uh... That looks like Papa! <laughs> Doesn't it? The, with this, Justin put up Papa when he made 12 hamburgers. That's him. <gasps> okay. Did you just get beat over the head with a goddamn stick? Uh, the rookie oh, mistake what? over here! Wow, oh, Jackson, I'm cringing. Dude, you're posting cringe right Dude, now, Dude, I just bro. posted cringe all over these bodies. Oh. <laughs> Jackson, you're you're beginning to piss me off with this gameplay you're here. You're beginning buddy. to get me pissed. I'm just kidding, Jackson. You... Can they not hire somebody competent at video games? I, I couldn't do this shit at all. I wouldn't even make it through the first room. God, nope. that I've never noticed those text effects. How nice they are. When they pop up. Yeah, like look at how like it like it changes perspective. You got this, brother. A brother. Where did the term uh, bro come from? Bro? Me? Bro, yeah. Is it what is it? It's like a it's like a term used, uh, I guess I guess heavily in the in the rap community, but it's oh, bro. Like I, I would have expected it's like the community the the, the uh, what's the community called the hype beast community. Yeah, I mean yeah, it's used in that too. There's a there's a very big overlap. Oh, oh dude, Jackson, God. I'm coming. I'm gonna kiss your thighs when I get I'm home tonight, go. Jackson. You're gonna be in bed because we have to stay late to record tonight. Cause uh, the, a new a new video game comes out tonight that that oh. we, we gotta record. But when I get home, I'm you can gonna... say what it is because it it's, no, it's coming out literally tomorrow. No, 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 this no, no, isn't coming no, out for no. like two weeks. It's the new Zelda game. <laughs> uh, but uh, I'm gonna kiss your thighs, your inner thighs. I'm gonna climb under the covers and you go, mm, and I'm gonna go. Give a little kiss on the thigh. I had a uh, professor who was like my professor on religion, except he was a priest. But like, he's like, now I take it differently than my like uh, religion. No, and I so take every it time, than every, my religion. Every time he uh, would go into teacher mode, he'd just make fun of Christianity, but he'd be wearing his collar and everything at the same time. Really? Yeah, he's like, it doesn't really make any sense. Is like if you think about it, but then but I don't he think would have that. students go to him to at like Christian students go to him after hours and like want to do Bible study and shit. What? That's interesting. I don't think he actually did it, because that would be against the rules. He's dead, which sucks. He was such a good <laughs> Plot guy. Plot twist. <laughs> I mean, by the way, he's dead. It's, I, I, like, I like the which sucks. <laughs> it does suck. <laughs> he was a very nice man. <clears throat> uh, oh, that was right into the mic. I'm sorry, Justin. Justin just fell back in his chair. Like like in the beginning of uh, Back to the Future when he plays the guitar so loud in the amps it blows him like back through the room. <laughs> it blows Justin him back to the computer. future. <laughs> Justin's in 1926 that. now. How you gonna do this one, dude? I bet if Justin could take one thing to a deserted island, he would take a hard drive of unedited Super Mega Let's Plays in his laptop. Those hula hoops we got him. <laughs> Wait, what, what's the series where we still have to do an episode so we can do the hula hoops? Is that an Animal Crossing? I think that was Animal Crossing. Fuck, he has those hula hoops, he hasn't used them. Oh, but we didn't record enough. The next episode has to start with that, doesn't it? Yeah. We haven't recorded more Animal Crossing yet. Oh, oh God. that motherfucker. They can see through the glass. I can't. I, uh, That's not fair. I can, I'm Why? lying. Wow, Ooh. Jackson, blaming the game. A Paul Vuxman blames his tools. <laughs> A poor Volksman. <laughs> yeah, Don. A poor Volkswagen blames its tours. I'm gonna start calling Don a Volkswagen. Let's buy all of our friends VWs for their birthdays. And then okay. And then <laughs> <laughs> guys, yeah. that'd be so funny. <laughs> you guys would get me so fucking good if you did that shit. I'd be so embarrassed driving around in a Volkswagen, dude. Uh, it would suck to have a car so much. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, you don't have a car. Yeah. What car do you, do you think you're, you you want to get? Because aren't you and Harrison going to get your own like car together? Like a cute little brotherly thing? Oh, yeah. fuck. Harrison's going to get a motorcycle. Yeah, him and I are going to go out and ride hogs. Yeah, and and I'm then we're going to go ride motorcycles. Hey! hey. <laughs> yeah, dude. Well, see, Ryan, I don't really do the riding. I more have uh, bitches ride me. Uh, yeah, you know I'm what I'm saying, it. dude? What, what is that? What do you mean? I have women, they, they get on top and they have sex with me. It's called writing. Well, did they ask for your permission beforehand? 
No, Get your parents' I, permission before, right? I gotta get my permission slip signed. <laughs> Mom, can Bing. I oh. remember when I was in high school, uh... I signed a permission no, slip? No, I, I mean, I, I had really bad, like, scrupulosity OCD, so the thought of having oh, sex scared mean? me really bad, because I was what's like... Scrupulosity? Uh, Matt, don't what's worry, I, I think you're fine. How many OCDs do you have? What's scrupulosity? What's this Scru new one? No, it's just like the... That sounds like a musical song. I, I, I thought that if just, I... Uh, I thought that, like, doing something like having sex would make me a horrible person. Uh, well, it does. So, I, but I remember I had this dream. My mom like was like, "Yeah, it's okay, son. You can have sex." And I was like so excited because like I was like, "Yes, I can finally have sex." Because I won't be a horrible person. Because my mom said it's okay. As long as a priest is in the room, like ordaining the whole thing, it should be fine. It's totally fine. Like your like your idea with the before you turn twenty one, having a glass of wine. I do think at that I, I think that that loophole would work. I don't think it would, brother. I I'm, I probably talked about it a long time ago on Super Mega, but like. I had an, a genius under, uh, idea to get away with underage drinking legally, which is, you get- Oh know, my god, who farted? Not me. It wasn't me. Sorry, not to interrupt the story, I just- Y'all smell that, right? Whoever smelt it- Might be my buddy. gooch, because I'm sweating up a no, storm. No, it's, it's- that's a fart, I smell that, that's bad. It ain't mine, I promise. That's that, really that ain't mine bad. either, that's a- I'll be honest, that was me, okay? I, so I was, why did you deny it at first, Matt? Because I was gonna try to do a funny joke, but then I realized neither one of you guys ever denies it when it's you, so... Why Why would I be that guy? So well, you tip. were that guy, you did deny it. Is a man not allowed to change? No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no, but basically, you know... Let's say you're 19 and you wanted to sip of alcohol, This but. sucks, this level seems fucking... Yeah, ooh. this one's hard. But basically, you just get a priest. To oh go my with God! You. I'm getting it. I'm sorry, Matt, to, to interrupt you, but did it God just drift damn. Over? Yeah, it's very, it's it's a very sulfury fart. It's it's pretty bad. I'm sorry. Or someone to describe it as eggy. Yeah, I don't know what's up. It's that's today because normally, normally when I fart, it really doesn't smell. Ooh. Oh, womp womp. Oh, someone just got. Um, oh, I got hit. Uh, oh, he just got hit, and now he's gonna go. It's the new uh, Hobo Johnson song. Hobo Johnson oh, is I was epic. playing Hotline Miami with my friends, but then they said, don't play that shit, man. Oh! <laughs> you do it pretty well. Because you, you have the kind of like raspiness in your voice that he has. Jesus, that's lingering, Matthew. I'm Wait, sorry, how, man. Did I, I die. Why didn't you, you? You get mad at Jackson whenever he farts in the room. Well, normally, what it, gives you the right to fart? And yeah, what gives you the, the fucking ha -ha? right, jackass? Well, well, the thing is, no, you know, you know me, Ryan. Normally, mine don't smell bad. Normally, they're pretty tame. So that's why I thought I would just, you know, get away with it. I didn't expect it to be like that. I'm, I apologize. This is for awful. That. Is it still there? Fuck, yes. <sighs> I'm just smelling the oh. cave of your asshole. You know, people would people would pay good money for that, Ryan. So consider yourself lucky. Yeah, some dumbasses <laughs> who worship let's players at the altar, maybe. Yeah, I know. but not your average Joe. That is hey. your average Joe. Anyway, what I was saying was, you know, you're underage. You take a priest. To, this already sounds. This is not where I'm going with it. But if you're underage, you could take a priest to a bar with you, and you know, you get a drink. He blesses the drink. And then it's then it's considered like holy wine. Just get a glass of wine. He blesses it. Then it's the blood of Christ, not actually an alcoholic beverage. And then you can drink it legally. Because and, and given the history of priests, I doubt you'd have a you'd, you'd find prob he'd you'd I'm, find a pri I doubt that you would not be able to find a priest that would want be to willing to help an underage child get alcohol. Yeah, he's like, no, no. Are you sure you don't want to? I can I can bless another one. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh no no no! I, I mean, it, if it's working, it's working. Let's keep blessing them. Oh, I'll bless I'll bless Fireball all around on me. <laughs> Hiya! Oh, imagine a priest blessing. Oh, fireball I was out of whiskey. ammo. Okay, now I'm gonna bless this condom. <laughs> <laughs> My, my priest never used a condom. <laughs> <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> Can't believe you fucking rode uh, in here in that in that ride that says whore on it. Damn. Uh, can we write whore on Matt's car? <laughs> <laughs> like spray paint it on the hood. No, can we can we like uh, use those like markers that you can easily like not easily wash off, but you have to do a good scrubbing. But we like write like you cheating bastard. Like and slashes tires. <laughs> oh, you guys would get me pretty good if you did that. No, you should just do it like when when child murderer, <laughs> child rapist on just the back of my car. Just write pedophile on that car. Like big big letters pedo on my back windshield <laughs> slash my tires. So all of my neighbors when they drive by are like, Matt, odds oh. are odds are you make you make. Oh, well, let me see. Hold on. 
Okay. Odds are you make pedo 420 your license plate. They won't let you do that. What? They they have what? like a vetting process for uh Yeah, but pedo means I could say I'm a pedometrist. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like I, I'm a... I, I don't think it's called that. <laughs> What is it? Podiat podiatrist. But, no, but isn't there a pedometrist too? Uh, there's a pedometer, a speedometer. No, but isn't there like there's an odometer? Because oh, there's there's a foot doctor Fuck. and there's a God pe oh pediatrician. I could say yeah, I'm the a, same thing. I could say I'm a foot doctor. Uh, I'm a pedotrician. Look, look at that. I like the like fat detective guy there. Where are they wearing like wife beaters? Oh no, no never it's, mind. it's like a. I thought it was like a. Uh, I thought the skin color was brown. No. Well, he could be. We we don't know. No, he's white. You can tell by his hands. Oh yeah, and he looks that. like Porco Rosso. <laughs> I love that movie, dude. I do too. It's in my top three favorite Miyazaki. Films. I heard it's amazing. Oh, he has a taser. Oh. God damn! Don't my, tase me, bro. My favorite's still Ponyo. I, I haven't. Seen my it. favorite's Nausicaa for sure. I love that one. Is that one. the one with the bugs? Yeah. I actually like that was one of my. Uh, that one's. Least, I feel like it was very that underappreciated. Was one, that was though. one of my least favorite ones. Really? Yeah. Man. My favorites are Ponyo, Kiki's Delivery Service, and Porco Rosso. Kiki. Mine are Porco, uh, Nausicaa, and, uh, what am I forgetting? Spirited Away? No, uh, what's the one in the woods? Castle in Mononoke. the Sky? Mononoke, yeah. Castle Mononoke is incredible. Castle in the Sky is really good. I haven't seen it. I, I've seen, uh, I've seen Totoro, I've seen, uh, Spirited Away, I've seen Mononoke, and I've seen, like, Howl's, oh, Howl's Moving Castle? I've seen, like, half of Howl's Moving Castle. Or maybe that, it was that's Castle another one where I'd like I, I, I forget I, Castle in the Sky all the time. It's very good at just like it is forgettable. What's the what? Okay, what's the in one? In terms where, of like when you think I think like I've watched realm. it th some of the least too. What's the one where there's a part where he's on like train tracks and he's like he's like on a little push cart or like biking on train tracks or something? Fuck, I don't know. It's a castle one. It's Howl's Moving Castle, Castle in the Sky. I don't remember, but I've seen like half oh, of that. Oh, uh, that's the beginning, the opening to Castle in the Sky. I think. Okay, then I've literally just seen that. <laughs> Okay. Uh, but out of the ones I've seen, I had never seen Spirited Away until not too long ago, and I saw it in theaters, and it was on, like, film, and it was beautiful. I really, really enjoyed you it. You know what movie I think you would appreciate and love? What? The Wind Rises. It's actually really Oh, The Wind good. Rises is really good. If I had to choose my the recent one? favorite one. Yeah, that's the most recent one. I, has he not done anything since then? Nope. He personally hasn't, but of course... His brother, or his son, not his Yeah, brother. but he didn't like his son's film. Yeah, he walked out of it. <laughs> yeah, started smoking a cigarette. He's what like, a, oh, what shit. a cock. <laughs> That's just a dick move. He's bad. I showed you the video, too. Yeah. <laughs> he just, like, walks out of his son's movie premiere. He's like, <laughs> should never make art based on emotions. I know, that, which is essentially all Miyazaki does. And that, But that's that's literally, I, I hate that statement. Because that, that's, I feel like that's just, I disagree with that so much. Because that's literally what art is, I think. Oh, but City Miyazaki, Boy knows what art is. <laughs> Miyazaki's known to be really fucking brutal. Did you see that whole thing? I know I've said it before. You saw the whole thing with him and the, yeah. like, 3D, like, game design model thing or Anime whatever. was a mistake. I think it was... <laughs> I'd like for him to critique our, our Let's Play channel. I'd like for Miyazaki to watch one of our Let's Plays and then give it like a he has to write he has to give like a five minute. I can give you. I can I'll give, give you his this number Let's Play channel two thumbs up. Welcome back, everybody, to a new episode. A brand new episode of Hotline Miami. That's we're, right, mother effers. We're back in our uh, we're we're in our abode now. Hold on. Give me that Jackson, drink, you Matthew. You want? you want your drink? Please. God, God, have that, my bo can that baby rotisserie bottle. chicken was so good, by the way. I, I didn't it have was. it from that place. Oh my God, it's <laughs> so good. We might have to. No, that place is like my favorite. Ooh. Zanko Chicken. Beck sings about it in a song. Who's Beck? Beck? Uh. You would know his He's music. He's a musician. What has he done? He's done a lot. I haven't really listened to much of Beck. My oh, summer I'm just getting a little sip of this for two seconds hey, before we start. My summer girl, my girl, to the crazy train. That's Beck? Yeah. <laughs> he also did this song he did, Loser. Where it's like. Uh, na, 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 na. I'm a loser, baby. So oh, that's back. Yeah. Okay, I know that shit. Uh, and I famously uh, did a nice lip syncing video of that song back when I was in sixth grade, <laughs> and still on YouTube. So, <laughs> so sorry, uh, Justin sent me a meme. Justin, share with the class. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this yeah. is what I want to show you. Alright, you both should watch this. Oh, my God. 
What? Justin, this needs to be in the video right now. I'm gonna send this to Justin. Okay, good. Justin, Justin put this one. Justin, in. you're gonna have to follow this account to save the video. <laughs> But it's worth it. This is my favorite Instagram account. You can screen record it and send it to him. Oh, is that? Okay, is that, is that uh, do that I'll do that later, Justin. Is that the Hawaiian guy? Yeah. No, Justin, that account is also definitely worth a follow. Actually, sh we, should we talk about that account? <laughs> it's this, like, random Hawaiian guy Jackson found. I was just, like, looking at the comments on, and like... He, he has, like, very few some followers, video. but he posts the best the shit. Fun literally, yeah, he posted the a video of funniest videos I've ever seen. Yeah, he posted... Actually, two. The banana no, one. clip? No, no, the electrical wires thing. Oh, really? Yeah. He just posted it? Yeah. Is it on that Instagram? Yeah. 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 He, he just posted, like, a bunch of stuff. Times I've, I've seen the thing around a lot. I saw on... God, some singer posted it. Or like there was some big response to some singer that like had that the she, electrical like, wires it. video. Yeah, really. It's been going around. You guys, uh, you guys got fans in high places. Hell yeah. Ooh, yeah longer Mr. combo. Soros window. is a fan. What do you? What do you? What genre of music would you say, Matthew, that you listen to the most? It changes a lot. Um, bet, dude. It's yeah, yeah. There you go. I'd say it, it's somewhere oh. between. Uh. Oh. K-pop? No. <laughs> no. It's probably- Wait, Matt, are you saying you don't like K-pop and its fans? No, I love K-pop and its fans. <laughs> huh. I, I would say it's, it's somewhere between like- A rock and a hard place. Indie? Uh, rap? Slash hip-hop? Well, the soundtrack to Indiana Jones? What do you mean, is it like, as a genre, indie? Yeah. yeah. Because uh, indie started as like a term for uh, but what, but just like, independent music, but it so it's not the same with movies sound. where like you have independent films, but they also are their own genres of like horror, yeah, uh, action. Like indie is its own solidified genre in music. Yeah, because it started to mean independent, but it was I think around the like early '90s is when it became you know very popular for these independent artists to make music, and then they definitely had a kind of unique distinct sound of them that kind of just became indie genre so and it's, also i feel like it, it also can be used as like an umbrella term for like yeah stuff like it very much is because you have like you know indie rock indie, indie pop, pop and things like that and it, it doesn't necessarily mean independent anymore though for this whole music. episode is just you teaching me things i do like bedroom I, pop, I like it, honestly because like, I, I, I like i'm not hip like you guys are. you're hip right you're, you're hip, hip in different ways. <laughs> i'm not i'm not i am not with it <laughs> <laughs> I'm not with it, G. Uh, I listen to that, and then I listen to uh, a lot of Bossa Nova. Bossa Nova is like those are the two mo like if you're Bossa playing, Nova, if you're playing music rap. in your car, or listening to it. You, you play that's accurate. Bossa Nova Indian rap. Like what is Matt? Listening I would to say that? so. Yeah, that's a pretty good. Uh, what would you say for me? For you, I, you I would actually say it. those three. I think. Um, actually, I, I don't know how to describe it, but there's like that genre of like internet kind of Japanese music. But it's more Japanese and it's fi Kind of lo-fi. I don't really listen to Japanese music anymore. It's oh, not Japanese oh. music, it's things that use like the Japanese aesthetic, you know what I'm saying? Like lo-fi? Kind of like lo-fi, but... There's also like rappers well, that get into that you did listen to that, that playlist too. for a while that had the, uh, oh, what movie? I, I saw it recently. Her. Whispers of the... Whispers of the Heart? Yes. That's also a good movie. A good oh, movie. the lo-fi chill playlist? Yeah. I love that still. Oh. That's just nice to put on sometimes. But it's sometimes. not like Japanese. Right. It's just so. I mean, that lo-fi is associated with like anime a lot. Just kind of like how vaporwave is associated with that kind of shit. Uh, yeah, no, Matt listens to vaporwave, danger music, <laughs> uh, and uh, and lollycore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of that. What, oh. about, what about you, Ryan? What are your like, dude? I what genre? Even, I you know me. It's just. I mean, everything. I listen to a lot of music. It's kind of hard like, for me to classify like one specific or two. I'm gonna look at genre. like. Yeah, a playlist right now that I have because let me see. I don't know what Spotify would tell me like well They do that thing every year, but it's not qu quite always like accurate because it's like this artist oh. play stuff basically like this but I, it's, I listen I, to this type of stuff. I, I like I like this music. Hold on. I have to fart. Can I? I mean, I'm not gonna tell you what to do with your body. I like driving music. I like See, that. I don't know what to call that than like oldies. Yeah, I like oldies. oldies. Yeah. I like uh, oldies are good though. I like rap. I, I like, love oldies. I like uh, the raps. I like I like the, the rap hippie stuff. and the hops. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say like I pretty much have a little bit of everything. But if That's I were if, if if I were to Yeah, I don't uh. know. I guess since I'm not I am into music, but since I'm not into it as much as you. But that's not a bad thing. I think everybody just that I wouldn't be able to classify like my top genres in terms of music. I, I don't. I, but also, I, I would definitely be able to oh say that gosh. I don't listen to 
like I don't listen to country as much as I listen to rap. I, I, I don't. don't I don't to... think. I also don't think that like you have to be like there's like a level of music like someone has to be into to like be considered into music because you know there's those guys on like 4chan's like MU, MU board that are they obnoxious yes well I mean it's being elitist about it which yeah is, like, it's, it's, being it's never like, fun elitist about either, music yeah. and like honestly like if you know three artists and that's what you like good for you like it doesn't no, fucking 100%. matter it's like because music I think music's like a personal thing it's like it, it's what you uh, like so like wait if you want to only listen to like three different artists your whole life that's, that's cool, totally fine oh, and if you fuck. know like 50,000 obscure artists that's cool too just uh don't be an elitist dick about it and if you are then you won't make many, you won't make many friends it, it's it's like you'll make friends in that circle well you make friends and you'll who, fight with them. whose only personality trait is hating on something yeah and I hate that shit. I hate groups like that. Oh, it's, it's just it's like toxic. Where it's like all you do is hate shit. That's really toxic. Where it's, it's like it's good to just kind of like every now and then, of course, you and your friends will gang up on something. But like it, if, it's fun to if, do that too. If sometimes. Literally, your only thing is, uh, uh nor uh, normies like that type of shit. It's so like obnoxious. I, I feel like I kind of uh, had a period where I was kind of into like. Uh, hating a lot of stuff, and I, it just made me well, feel like women. <laughs> well, I feel like that's also like an age thing. Like I think when you're in your late, like teens I to was, early twenties, you're very, you're very much like that. Yeah. Just people are. But then it, I just made me feel shitty all the time. Well, I'd, I'd be angry because it's just so much negativity. Because like you don't realize it's just, it's just like constant. Like even though like you know it's not like bad God. things are happening to you, but like it's just constant kind of negativity going through your head, and that really does affect your mental state a lot. And it really does kind of you start to like almost define yourself by not liking by not liking things, things. which is like that's the dumbest thing. It's like I, my, I'm known for not liking things. Like how is that interesting? Like you, have you, you ever heard of the you, angry video you, game nerd? You become. <laughs> It's like <laughs> you become interested by the by the taste that you have and the likenesses that you have there. I guess also you could like if you don't like something with someone, you could also form a relationship on that. But it just feels like it's, it's I think, very but, cynical. But it, it, it's it's not a something you can build a relationship with. Yeah. Also, I think uh, I, I think like nihilism oh. and like apathy. Because I saw this on actually your brother's story. The Big story. Lebowski. On your brother's story, uh, he posted what, some like screenshots. What was of that? Text. What was that? I don't know what that was. <laughs> I, but was I read like, it. I was and, that text. And I was, was like, it Carson or yeah. Yes. Carson posted like some really long screenshots of text where someone was just explaining. But I, I agree with part of it where it was like I did too. But it, I was like, that's kind of like, weird. Wait, is this someone's <laughs> conversation with him. It, but he was talking about like uh, it was like how apathy is like. I mean, I agree. Really like, like normalized. Because like thinking it's cool it's to not cool care. To, like, not care about shit. Well, I mean, look at like, shit like Billie Eilish, for example. Like she's big and hip right now, and her whole thing is is being kind of like, uh, right? Isn't Aww. that her like? Style yeah, I her think way? so. It, it's like That's, it's um, cool with kid. I think yeah, it's cool with younger audiences more because when you're young, you want to stand out, and so you don't want to be a part of things that you see as normal, and so you try to differentiate yourself <sighs> by not liking those things. I you, think. Oh. I mean, you got you gotta have passion, bro. You gotta care about shit. That's that's what makes life. Uh, I feel like if you don't care, if you if you're, if you're just like nihilistic and apathetic, then oh, life just sucks. I'm also not trying to shit on Billie Eilish. I legitimately like have like I think one of her songs in a playlist of mine. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I, don't like, mean, I, I like one of their songs. <laughs> I mean, I, you did see I went Billie to a Eilish, concert. Though. Yeah. Well, mostly because the opener. Who didn't show up was supposed Dude, to be Dude, Denzel Curry? Wait, he didn't show Curry. up? No. He, he, it was like the Vegetable Boys, or I can't remember. No, it, it was Earth Gang, which Earth, Earth Gang is really sorry. fucking good, though. They're, they're, I didn't. Live, I, it seemed more like a circus than. than it, it, it seemed like they just didn't plan to perform, which is true because oh, they didn't, fuck. I guess. But I was really. I was just like. You know, there's where you're in the mood to, like, oh, I'm excited for Denzel Curry, and no matter who else comes on, it's just. Well, like, it, oh. it's not what you came for. Yeah. But that's fine. Oh. Let me tell you something, though. I, uh, apart from parents bringing their kids, I, me being a 25 year old, I was probably one of the, like, oldest people there. No, I Brent was like... the oldest person. <laughs> well, there. Yeah. Well, they probably thought Brent was my dad, and he was bringing me. I'm back, yeah. Like, oh, look I'm at that. Look at that. Brent. Look you at that look dad like bringing his gay son to the Billy Eilish yeah, concert. Yeah, don't insult yourself, Ryan. Brent, you look like my teen dad. 
Eh. Oh, so I look like a teenager. Thanks. <laughs> no, Brent. What? See, Ryan, is in, if you felt embarrassed being a 25-year-old male at that concert, at least you you weren't Brent. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck that. Welcome back, everybody. Woo! Welcome back. We're starting the final chapter of Hotline Miami. Can you believe it? What you boys feeling? Ooh, what was, See, that? Whoa, was that a fucking cobra? That's a rat. Choose whatever's have a cobra. gonna make it easier for you. Oh, yeah, well, dude. We got a gator, a walrus. What's your a bat. favorite? What's your favorite character? To that play I have as? unlocked. See, I mean, I do love the uh, rabbit, but I feel like I've done that one every time. I mean, dude, do what's easier yeah, for you. The rabbit's fine. I'm gonna keep going with it. You know, it's. Uh, I think the rabbit's cute as fuck. Look at those little buck teeth. You ever been bitten by a rabbit? Yes. That's shit. I used to own a rabbit. Really? You had a pet rabbit? Yeah. I hated it. Dude, rabbits are easy to hate. They're very around. cute, but like when they bite. It's also not one bite. It's like they do that series of brrr, like that. Oh, well, like it's almost. It's uh, it's kind of like it's the same thing as a guinea pig bite. Because like they'll they'll do like three fuck guinea pigs. By the way, they'll do like three rapid fire bites, and only one of them will be really hard. So it's like, <laughs> if you own a guinea pig, take them out of their stupid goddamn enclosure, and set them free, and uh, and place them in front of this let's play, and uh, let them hear this. Fuck you, you suck, and you're a shitty pet. Okay, thank you. You bite people, you smell oh, bad. Oh, Matt, it looks like our garage. Yeah, that does look a lot like our <laughs> garage. Is this Captain Sparkle's garage? <laughs> hey, guys. Aw, oh, man. More like Captain Fartholes. Dude, Ooh. he did a video for us. I'm sorry. No, I love Captain Sparkles. <laughs> Captain Nice Guy. Use doors strategically. Wait, do you guys remember that old animated series on fucking... Maybe it was on Miniclip, but it was about the grandma that had really sagging titties? Do you remember those Flash cartoons? And there would be music videos, and there was one where it was like, Hey, ya, uh, Grandma. See, I, I never saw that one. But do you remember who I'm talking about? Like, the grandma with the really, I do know what you're really long about. titties. Yeah. I just remembered that. Sure. Remember. Do you, you remember that, that old no, video that, like, your okay. parents would send through email where it would be like, uh, is an old couple, and there's, like, the woman with the fake wheel oh, dri yep. driving the car, and then she... Fake turns into the other car and like makes them all scared and shit. That's how and that's how shit got <laughs> spread back then, you know. Oh. Just via email, like I the Pixar mouse. Dude, I love that. I, thing. I remember my my parents getting via email something called the fruitcake lady, and it was this old lady who's just said very bad words in her videos. How come no one's posted the fucking Pixar mouse to our subreddit, huh? I believe in and said Tucker I Prescott from Super Mega. I uh. Where are you from? You, you sex a thing, sex a thing, yo. Yeah. I believe in. <laughs> what was uh? There was one viral video. Yeah, that song just reminds me of a. Uh, what's that Christian song? It's like da 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 da. da. On the outside looking, you know what I'm talking about. Shine, oh, it's shine. shine. Yeah. Let it shine. Let shine? It, what? Yeah. I don't think I know that one. Yeah, neither do I. Oh. I know. Oh, heaven let, let your, your light shine down. down. Oh. Why don't we just start a band, guys? A cover band. We love only that song. <laughs> By, uh, who sings that shit? I forgot. It's but we do shine different down. styles of covers. There's a, fuck, is it, I think Suda51 has a band like that, like the game developer, where like, he just covers the same song in different styles. That's amazing. Oh, I want like a ska cover that like, Come here, suckers. Come on, look at me. Hey guys, uh, a, there was a gaffe. Uh, here to explain it is Jackson, Jackson Tucker. Jackson, what happened? Oh, say hi, Matt. This oh, hey guys. Anyways, go on, Jackson, explain it. What happened? You used to call me <laughs> <laughs> so, we were uh, recording our Let's Play, and as soon <laughs> Alright, I'll stop that. I'm. Th I actually made us redo the ending because I didn't get to make that joke the first time we played. <laughs> he went and wait deleted the file off the computer. Yeah. Hey, he wished that he had done it so bad. I was like, God it. damn it. So I put on a ski mask and broke into the office. Even though I have a key, I smashed a window and came in the back. To make it look realistic. And just wiped everything off of Ryan's That's hard drive. <laughs> it's so weird. They only targeted my hard drive. <laughs> Which they actually. They save file. The, well, the footage wasn't even on Ryan's hard drive. Jackson forgot it was on the recording computer, so he accidentally just wiped Ryan's hard drive for no reason. Which has the next Japan video. Well, 
it's already come out. No, it has. I don't know. No, it maybe. Well, no one y'all to it hasn't. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Um, but we were, uh, you know, trying to get the air fixed after Brent broke it, and Brent two came <laughs> along and started whacking the old uh, the thermostat, the, the thermostat with a hammer, and somehow short all the power in the recording room. Literally, the second that Matthew hit save. This is not a joke. On the finale of Hotline Miami, we had just beat the game. Ryan and I, I go to stop the audio. Ryan goes to stop the video. I'm not kidding. The second we click stop on the mouse, the power just goes. Doom. And I, it, it was so in sync. It wasn't enough time for anything to render. Or no. And, and it was actually so in sync with the click that I did that I thought that maybe by clicking uh, save that I had shorted everything out somehow because it was that in sync with the. And, and we just all looked at each other in silence. And we were like, well. There goes the finale of Highline Miami. So we're back uh, a week later. I had to give it some time. I know. I have a breather. A... We were pissed, but we're back to re record this. We're here this. for reshoots. Reshoots, mm -hmm. yeah. And you know what happens with reshoots? Well, it's, it I'm never just comes mad out because as good. The first time that we did it, I got S, like triple S rankings on every level. Yeah. And the power actually made my score go down in the game, too. So oh. you guys just don't get to see that. Yeah, <laughs> that's unfortunate. Jackson got shocked. Uh, when but the power went do, out. Do so. you want to take us back to where where we were yeah. in the last episode? Uh, for this Goryacha wonderful Chaya. finale? Goryachaya Miami. Fun and games. Here we go. Well, here Jackson goes. Come on, oh, ooh. Oh. Jackson, see, you were, you practiced before we started recording. No, I, I thought you'd be a bit that, better. The, the, see, Jackson was playing with the outlet around the same time, and he got shocked, so it might have might have fried some brain cells. You guys ever really shocked yourself bad? Uh, yeah, I walked in on my parents. <laughs> Doing what? Uh, arm wrestling. <laughs> nice. And I was like, no! come here, sucker. I walked I walked Aww. in on my dad arm wrestling with another dude. But it, it looked like a baby's arm. He was crazy. My dad was just holding it, and he was just come shaking it so fast trying to beat him. Looks like a baby's hand holding an apple. And, he, and my dad's... from again? Oh, what is that? Gold member. Oh, God. It's when... Uh, Gold it's, member is so good. It's when um, uh, Austin Powers' dad is trying to you know make mini me feel good because dr evil has his love is back for seth green's character who plays his son now mini me's jealous and so he's like i don't like the way he treats you like that because it's michael kane who plays austin powers dad you might know as alfred in the dark knight trilogy oh i thought you said michael keaton plays no, his dad I was michael kane like, well okay michael kane and he goes oh wow that's a sizable one looks like a baby's hand holding an apple and then, uh, God, Austin Powers is so good. I haven't seen it still, man. I was listening to the soundtrack. You haven't seen any of them. Up earlier today. Dude, <laughs> the, <laughs> dude, the third one has Kevin Spacey, Tom Cruise, Danny DeVito, Gwyneth Paltrow. Kevin Spacey has Britney it? Spears, Steven Spielberg. What? And all just in the first five minutes of the movie. That's kind of like in Zoolander too. How it they just wait like... the first or the second? Do you mean like Zoolander? Number two or Zoolander as well? Oh, Zoolander number two. Uh, the movie okay. starts with Justin Bieber getting killed. He's like being chased by a gunman and the gunman kills Justin Bieber. I didn't like Zoolander 2. I didn't either. However, you watched it again? I, I watched it again and I really enjoyed it. It was something about watching oh it, goodness. like, back, something about the time I watched it, it just wasn't funny, but something about, like, I don't, it, like, aged, like, two years and now it's funny somehow. It's almost more fit for 2019 than... Uh, the year it came out, which was twenty what seventeen. The social climate wasn't ready. It, it wasn't ready for a, for a piece of cinema. I'm Neil like deGrasse Tyson, too. bitch. Now that part <laughs> that part's not funny still. That, that part aged like wine. <laughs> it only gets better as time goes on. I really can't Is there stand about Neil deGrasse, deGrasse Tyson. Tyson assaulting someone. Or did I dream that? I don't think he that, assaulted. That was anyone. that. Well, that was a personal experience you had, Jackson. But you blocked. Maybe it out. that was a bit we did on something even. <laughs> uh, who who knows if it's real or fake now? Neil Neil deGrasse. I like how Jackson always says Neil deGrasse Tyson. Yeah, like he's smoking that show. grass. <laughs> that's good. That's really good. <laughs> yeah, after after Drake got too big, they replaced his character in uh, deGrasse oh, with uh, oh, the, Neil deGrasse wow. Tyson. Good one, Jackson. Thanks, fellas. We're uh, fellas. We're at the end. Are we? Shit. Yeah. Already? Yeah. Damn, you did this considerably faster than last time. I know. So this can be a short ass. I was about to be like the la last time I did was like an hour. Damn. Are you hacking right now? Bro. What's this? <gasps> Looks like I need a password to access this computer, which uh, I believe you might have gotten from uh, that guy's room, didn't you? Ah, there we go. No, the password was uh, 
when I did charades last time. Oh yeah. What, oh. Can we can we throw that up? We still have the video. So yeah, base. I'll go to that in a second. So. Oh yeah, we'll throw so that up that's in a bit. Your game, huh? Oh shit. Yeah. So uh, basically, what I did in each level was collect these little puzzle pieces, and we had a. Uh, <laughs> You had to like kind of solve what the puzzle is, and it was fun because I gave it to Matt and Ryan to try and solve. And we had no idea like what what the letters were supposed to what it was supposed so to spell out. So he was doing out. charades for the the last. The, the, I, they just got I was because I was like uh. But um. Kind of helping them there. But uh, here's the footage from the better episode. Okay, Jackson. I like it because we can see the answer on the left side yeah, of the so screen. I like that a lot. Four letter word. Four letter. Yeah. I was full. I was I was fast. I was wait, what? I was swimming asleep. I was I was born. I was, I was, I was born. born, I was born oh, yesterday? Okay. No. That would be I wasn't born yesterday. I was born in I was born in. I was born in Wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me slow the ass. Again. I was born in the. In I was the, in the. Hold on, I can't see. We can make it out. Um, in the. C. USA. Oh, dude. I was born in the yes. USA. Woo. Okay. God bless <laughs> the Bruce Springsteen speed. Speen, dude. Bruce Springsteen. Hell yeah. Wasn't that nice? That was very nice. That was, fun. That was sweet. Now, now because of this, Jackson. Without further ado, would you like to go? Uh, yeah. See I, the ending. It was great. I made a I made a bunch of Bruce Springsteen jokes. Oh, and then Matt said he doesn't like Bruce Springsteen, which I did say that. Yeah, I'm just not a big Bruce Springsteen guy. Did I, he do something? He's fantastic. I find he actually his, his birthday the other day. I find his music annoying. Have you listened to his albums? I've listened to a, a, a fair amount of Bruce Springsteen. I think "Born in the USA" is a very annoying song. I, I mean, I agree. That's a, a lot of his fans even aren't. Listen, if you if you like Bruce Springsteen, though, more power to you. What I, makes I it think annoying? He's one of the best musicians. What makes it annoying? Uh, especially the Born in the USA. Musicians. Just keep saying that over Listen and over. Listen to Nebraska. Okay, I'll think I'll have to give Nebraska's it a listen. A I'll, I'll give it a so second is, uh, chance. Born to Run. My dad was a massive Bruce Springsteen fan, and you know it permeated. <laughs> I do. That's fucking Brian Silva. I say it every time oh, it I is, guess though. This is the ending of the game. You're the asshole from Phone Home last night. That dude kind of looks like E.T. What, do you, what want? do you want? So you can't take all the voices. Do you want to do... Okay. Jackson, you do him. I'll do Brian Silva, and you do the girl, Ryan. Okay. It's not a girl. They're both men. Okay. Oh, is it not a girl? You know they're both men because they're uh, American nationalists. Okay. <laughs> All right, so you're the main character. Go, Jackson. Well, I need a good voice. Just, just do your regular. You're playing as yourself right now, right? To the hero. Yeah, baby. I looked through the computer upstairs. Is that like Austin Powers and Forrest Gump? <laughs> yes. Yeah, baby. I'm the Joker, baby. <laughs> I'm the Joker, baby. <laughs> so I got these kick-ass new Gunner glasses. It's <laughs> a perfect Heath Ledger. <laughs> You want to know how I got these gunner glasses? <laughs> <laughs> and who do I see wearing them? <laughs> Soldier, Soldier Boy. boy. <laughs> <laughs> I hate Soldier Boy. You know what those glasses should say? Douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> God. I love it too because that kid has a Joker uh, poster in his room. Wait, did people even know really? about that video? Yes. Is that a popular video? The gunner glasses not, one? It's not like insanely Has it popular. blown up at all? One of his videos has like a hundred thousand views, so I don't think he's like blown up. And that one doesn't even have that many. It's basically just a video of this kid who's reviewing his new gunner glasses, but he's pissed off that he saw a picture of Soldier Boy wearing them, and he has a great voice. <laughs> What's it called? It's just just type in a uh, Soldier Boy gunner glasses. It's really good. His whole channel is gold. It's good. I watched him today. Was uh, Love Guru first impressions? <laughs> it was like he's like I'm going so to see just, it in theaters. <laughs> they just announced this new movie, Love Guru. <laughs> it looks great. Uh, <laughs> it looks great. Yeah. yeah, no, no, he was he coming has, out good at looks. He has a review of the whole Blade trilogy on his channel. <laughs> and how they get better as they go on. Dude, it's such a good gold mine. I, like. I, I mean, there's like, there's like, screw you porn addicts. That was one of the videos, <laughs> like 300 views. I mean, there's like, uh, he has some political takes. Oh, it was like, uh, my issues with Hillary Clinton. And it's like, back during the Obama-Clinton campaign, but he was pretty ahead of his time. He's like... She's just using the race card and saying he might be a terrorist because his name is Obama. And I'm like, this kid kind of woke. Yeah, I'm just like, like, and I, I, I thought we should have a little talk about your 
line of work. <laughs> I guess we should play the game. You don't know. <laughs> you don't know. Shit. Our system's password protected. N nope. Oh, oh, is that me? See, I took Jackson's character. Oh, you character. took me. Oh, okay. So I guess that's Jackson. I'm Motorcycle now. Man now. That looks oh, like Jackson. So. That does look like me. So that's you now. Go, 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 go. No one knows the password but the two of us. <laughs> I was born in the USA. Born in, in the, the USA. USA. How the hell did you figure that out? Ryan, that's you. Knock it off. <laughs> Let's just say I used a little magic. So let me get this straight. You're nationalist scumbags? Wait, you're nationalist scumbags. You threaten your members into doing your dirty work. Oh. Thought he was going to say bidding. And this whole thing is a two man operation? Th this is when I started working for Super Mega and I realized <laughs> what they were doing behind the videos. <laughs> this whole thing's a two man operation? You could say that, though we like to call ourselves patriots. Uh, we volunteered to conduct this little experiment by ourselves. <laughs> I can assure you, we're just the tip of the iceberg. <laughs> we're setting up operations all over the country. How did you come up with this crazy scheme? Crazy? What you need to realize is that... Uh, all you gotta do is get people to do what you want. Them too. <laughs> <laughs> I, was like, I was like... He's like tripping over his own words. Fuck? It's a principle our whole society is built upon. So it's okay to threaten people into killing each other? See, we read some of these. But yeah, I, I guess we're skipping some. Oh, yeah. Wake then... up, man! <laughs> I Don't love you that. see this is a country at war? Come on, man! 50 blessings. Here, here's where it went, because it was my line. 50 blessings is a foundation for patriots. Our members must fill out a form in which they state that they're, that they're willing to die for the sake of our nation. You might remember this. You remember too, right? <gasps> and you expect to topple the Russo? Amer Ru Russo? Russo? I think it's pronounced Russo. When Russo, you use yeah. The, the prefix. And you expect to topple the Russo-American coalition <gasps> using methods like this? <laughs> oh, don't you worry about that. We'll have this country back on its feet soon enough. Give us five years, and you'll see what we're capable of. Did the second one come out five years later? Oh. No, they couldn't have been that second long. second one was 2014, I think. I forget what year the first one is. Yeah, this is just the first step. You'll understand in time. We've got some very powerful people on our side. Let's players. You know what? Oh, oh. I think I've heard enough now. I have no interest in politics. You people have wasted enough of my time already. <laughs> Chapter clear, dude. Can you kill them? You should I kill, can them. kill them. You should. Don't well, let them get away. Last with time this. we had the whole uh, the moral debate. See, they got the. Oh, see, you can uh, find masks. Oh, we mask. got Phil. Didn't do that last time. And a boy named Phil and his family, family on vacation from the 22nd oh. century. Oh shit! I love Something how the. Time machine how did that happen? What? You like punched way, them way, and the guts just the spilled out. No, you, you have a little. Oh, knife. you slashed them. You sliced them. Together just as best as we can. Feel, feel, feel of the future. He's a 22nd century man. 22nd century man. Alright, so we just killed those guys. And as you walk out, you start hearing the. I know when the hotline blinks. Alright! Was it better the second time, guys? Yeah, it was actually. Sure, yeah. I think it was. Okay. I had a lot of fun. Me too. Thank you guys for tuning in. That's a that, that's another completed series. Jackson, thank you so much for coming on and hey, guiding us through time. this. Playing it. I've, I've always wanted to play this on the channel, but I've just never been uh, good enough to play a game like this. So it's nice to have a friend come on and show us something fun that they that they like. Thanks for being honest, Matt. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to make excuses. I'm just bad at video games. And, uh, Jackson, <laughs> what do you want to do now? I want to... Uh, let's play the second one right now. All the way through? You guys can't get off the couch. Okay. Um. Go set it up. All right. Let's go. All right. See All you right, guys. Bye.